Welcome back you guys to another Mighty BB does let's look at. This is FTL. More specifically advanced edition, but FTL stands for faster than light. This is a pixel game from 2012 subset games. So we're going to do new game. Confirm. And you see we have a few ships. The Taurus and the Kestrel. We're going to be probably taking the Kestrel. Looks kind of cool. We're probably not going to be playing with Advanced Edition, but that came out in 2014 to let you guys know. We're going to play on easy, and I don't get that far anyways because I'm not good at the game. But here's our crew. We get to take them with us. This is our ship. And we're going to jump kind of right into the gameplay just to... Well, no. Well, this is not going to be the Kestrel. We're going to call this the Enterprise. Enter. And this, by the way, this might be a longer video. And we're going to have Kirk. Spock and Picard, probably the three best names known. And we're going to begin on uh, the date. You, the data. You, I mean, sorry about the data. The data you carry with you is vital to the remaining Federation fleet. You need supplies for the journey, so make sure to explore each sector before moving to the next. But get to the exit before pursuing Rebels' fleet catch up. Tip death. Remember, losing part of the, is part of the fun. No, I'm serious. You do lose a lot in this game. So we get to power up our ship. Let's put two power to weapons, one power to fuel, and uh, they start guys. So we're gonna save their layout. My mouse is really jumpy in this game for some reason. Let me check that for a second, you guys. Options. Frame limit off. Nope, 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 nope. Nope. No sound can be up. Music go down a little bit. Oh, okay, never mind. I guess we're just gonna play like this. So. We're going to just fly off. We're going to jump. And we're going to go to this sector. Now this game has a lot of combat mechanics, of course. The unidentified ship is badly damaged, still being assaulted by a space pirate. The victim begins distress signal until the pirate cuts off and offer to split the bounty if we use it tight. So we can get two missiles, one um, radio component, and 12 gears. Or we could be a hero and fight the pirates. So that's the pirates. They only got one laser, so we're gonna attack the pirates. Continue. Oh, I did not see that they had that. Okay, we're gonna auto fire because I like that because I'm lazy. We're gonna auto fire on their shields. They're probably going to try to escape at some point though, because that's what's really cool about this game, more or less too, is the fact that you get to target specific weapons systems and uh, core systems that they have oh we took a little bit of damage on that one I'm going to take out their drone because that's a slightly better offer now they're probably gonna try to j they're not gonna try to jump away yet interesting choice there's many different ways to win this game by the way as some people would think going for the oxygen so then you can starve out the crew is best sometimes. Oh. Oh, never mind. I was going to say we would have been better off taking the other one. Jump. Here's the distress signal. We're going to respond. Gonna go down to the surface. You find a colony that seems to have been recently attacked exploring. You find a lone survivor. Invite him to join your crew. Charlie. Pilot. 
Who's a better pilot, Charlie or Picard? Or who's piloting? Spock. So he's a better pilot. So we're going to move him to... We're going to move you to here. Okay, and we're going to save this crew layout. And then we're going to... Yeah, save. Then we're going to jump. Now I want to get back to the store. So we're going to go to that, back to this sector for a second. Uh, you arrive at a damaged and dilapidated space station. It appears that it's abandoned. You find a faint life sign signal board. Uh, we lost a crew member. So we're going to have to send him now to do that. That's kind of unfortunate. Sometimes you can gain people from that mission. I was all about that. So we're going to go to the store. We're losing kind of a lot of fuel. It's not a big concern, but... So we can get... So let's see. We can't afford any of those fancy things. Um... That's probably worth it. Hmm, that's pretty good too. Since those two aren't skilled, we're just going to buy this. And we're gonna close. Or we're gonna buy one hole. And then we're going to go to ship upgrades. And uh, we can't afford doors. That's the most important, I'd have to say, probably. So we're just going to jump for the moment, but... That was very useful. You guys don't know how useful it is to grab um, your materials. If I knew that there was an automatic weapon reloader... I really want that. We're gonna try to come back to this place if we can, because I really want that a lot, actually. Um, eh, ignore the station. We're good. So unfortunately, we're not gonna be able to buy that because it's gonna be swarmed by rebels, and if we get stopped by the rebels, we're gonna be in a whole lot of trouble. Once you arrive, the screen lights up with warnings, and nearby pirate seem to advance have advanced hacking tools. Ooh. Not a big fan of that. Okay. So we're gonna target their shields. We have a, by the way, if you guys haven't noticed in the... Ooh. That kinda hurt. So I guess now we pair A with Attacking their weapons. Oh. I see what you're doing there. Don't get those shields back up. Oh wow, that was easier than I thought. Yeah, we should be getting 10% more scrap. Ah, uh, but we can afford that now. Yeah, we can't go there. It's unfortunate, but it's what well, it has to be. So this is the rebels. Okay, so we want their weapons down immediately. Because that missile ignores all shields and just will attack you no matter what. Oh, they hit us right in the shields. Okay. One second here. My mouse is freaking out. I wonder why that is. Okay, so what do we gotta do? What do we do? First off, we have to open these. Why can't I open the door? Oh, they took out our doors. That is not good. 
So you, Spock. You go to the doors. Okay, I guess we're gonna have to continue. We're gonna just have to take that out. We can't afford this kind of damage. Okay, you guys. Now, unlike a traditional game, we're not in the clear yet. Because we are still venting oxygen. So we're going to close all doors and open all doors. And we're going to need you to go and fix that immediately. So we got to hurry. Hurry, 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 hurry. Okay, you guys, we survived. This game has a lot of dangers like that, and our oxygen levels should be rising. So now we just gotta, in general, send people out to repair. Oop, oh, did I not select you? Oh, sorry. The whole ship. Actually, you stay in repair. Charlie, you go back to the bridge. You're a bridge guy. Card, you go here. And after he does that, sorry, this is taking a while, you guys. I'm going to. Actually, all I had to do, I think, is push enter, and then they should all go where they need to go. Yeah. So they go to their assigned slots. And we're ready to jump. We took a lot of damage there, though. The exit's down there, so. Not quite ready to go. Drive the rebels into releasing the civilian ship. Shut down all night. Another rebel checkpoint monitoring a number of civilian ships waiting. Hmm, so they didn't give us anything. We had to get to the exit. So that was kind of a bust level, so we're gonna die pretty quick, I'm pretty sure. Military vessel. I'm an engineer, I could improve your reactor. Yeah, we don't use any of that, so continue. So and then now we can put that extra power into here, which gives us a extra 10% dodge. It's pretty good. We're still recovering oxygen, I guess. We were more crippled than I thought. Next sector. Zoltan controls are uncharted. We're gonna go to Zoltan. They're pretty weak, but they have uh, and then of course we're in a nebula anyways. Nebulas are not fun. I want to find a store though because we got to heal. So we're going to just plain out attack their weapons. Okay, so that did pretty good. There we go. That's easy enough. <laughs> Remember, this is the easiest mode in the game. As sad as that is with my performance. I usually do better, but my mouse is really spastic for some reason. This will be a longer video if I have not mentioned that before. So we're just going to go full on weapon. No, shields and weapons. Ooh, that missile missed. I'm not comfortable using another missile. I'm gonna have to just shoot. Oh, that one didn't. Luckily it hit a non-vital area, but... Could've caused some serious problems for us. Come on, hit them before they get those shields up. 
Yeah, okay, there we go. So now we're rich, but we need... Well, actually I guess we can do some stuff on our own. Like level 2 doors. I feel like that's just something that's always needed. Because if somebody bored you, otherwise... Oh, there's a shop. I probably would have saved our money if I had seen that, but that's why you're supposed to check. Crew teleporters, no. No. Might not be a bad idea to pick up another crew member. But we're going to have to fix all of our damage. Yeah, so we can't afford that. So let's do some of our own stuff. Ship. Um, we're going to want... Yeah, we're going to get that. Because that makes it to where we don't always have to have a pilot in the chair. Which is very useful. No, I'm not going to make a mistake and go two shops in a row. Okay, these can get really annoying. Oh, and they have a shield too. That's, that sucks. They're going to rip right through us. Yeah, that's going to hurt. They've got to launch a missile, unfortunately. Oh, they've taken out our weapon systems entirely. Truthfully, if we just keep out their shields, they'll just get torn apart by these asteroids, so that's something that we can use to our advantage, kind of. So as long as our shields are out, we're going to be weak to these asteroids. I had to fire off a missile, because we're about to get shot. And that would have hurt a lot. Oops. I don't know how to deselect this. Okay, there we go. So now we're going to check out this store. Considering we made a pretty penny back. So more cloaking, more drone control. Now we can sell stuff too. I say we say goodbye to the Archimedes. No. And we buy the two power required, eleven shots. Three power required. So this is our only real option. And then from there we go ship. I may not have thought this through all the way. No, it's okay. So what we do is we minus one of our engine power, but we get burst laser two up and ready too. And we're ready to jump again. In easy mode, it's apparently harder to fail, but I fail all the time, so. So we're going to go all in for their weapon systems this first time. The weapons charge up at roughly the same time, luckily. Okay. So those are out. Now we go all out for the shields. This is sustainable, I think. Nope. No. Okay, I'm gonna have to open these doors too. Okay, there we go. Vent the fire out in space. We haven't had anybody try to run, which is kind of odd. Much better deal for us.
There's actually a race in the game, though, that's pretty much overpowered because they just live in an anti-oxygen environment. And they create it. So then that way, you know, you can vent out fires all day or just... Well, actually, the whole ship is just constantly vented. Yeah, we'll attack. Continue. Okay, so they have a drone, which is kind of what I was worried about. Truthfully, I'm only worried about that Hal beam. It's gonna hit us. Oh, we got so lucky with that. Okay, so now we gotta go for that turret. Oh, they actually hit our sensors. Luckily, they very slowly self-repair. So we're going to repair this. It's very good. So after we repair our sensor system, which everything in the game is useful, like if we repaired that to the next level, then we could actually see the enemy crew, if they had any. So we're just going to wait a second here. Yep. I clicked that way early. My mouse is kind of, like I said, freaking out though, that's what I'm for. Uh, I'd rather send you in there too. You might as well get healed. You can get healed too. And then everybody would go back to where you belong. I really feel pretty safe though, considering the doors are now level 2. Okay. You arrived lumbering home. It's a mystery what happened to the crew, but it's a shame to let the opportunity go to a waste, so we gained a lot of stuff. So we go to ship. And we probably buy more power. And. more shields there we go so now we have level 2 shields should have done this sooner probably okay I think we can do this that was pretty risky with no reward unfortunately so now we just wasted fuel something you really don't want to do in this game I like the style of the game though, it's very nice even though it's pixeled. Okay, so now we're gonna go here. Already probably the longest video I've ever put up. I like the distress. I like to help out those in need. Ooh. Now these guys like to transport over. So we're going to pause here, and we're going to vent out this entire space. Like anywhere that that guy could go, we're going to vent. That way he's going to just, he's going to want to run and hide. Luckily we got level 2 of that though. Okay, so we're going to pause here again. Now what we're going to do to be real sneaky is, We're going to pull these two in here, and we're going to open up all this. So then, he'll get oxygen out on the other end too. Yeah. And while we're doing that too, I probably should have been hitting their shield. We will not accept surrender. Sweet. 
And now everybody can go back to their stations and we're all fine. I'd say we handled that pretty good. If I do say so myself. I'm gonna go to this store, even though I don't plan on buying anything necessarily. <laughs> and NG good at damage. Now you see that's kind of funny because they're they're one of the weakest in the game race wise. So we don't want any of that. So we're gonna fix ourselves, and we're gonna close, and we're going to. I think we're just going to. Yeah, get more power. Put it into engine so then we have a better chance to dodge. You, What's funny about this game is so you can get like 100%, like 130% of things. Don't hire any. Kind of would have rather hired, I guess, but you never know with this game what's going to be around the corner. So, oh, we're running low on fuel. We're running dangerously low on fuel. And yet that store is not really an option. Now, if running out of fuel means that all you gotta do is wait turns for somebody to come help you, essentially. Huh. I didn't realize we were that low, otherwise I would have bought a lot. Yeah, Doc... Uh, we had to, though. We had to at least try. Whoa! boarding drone you two get on the oxygen that's a must <laughs> that is a necessity So we're gonna try to shoot them down because they're trying to run. Which as soon as we destroy them, that guy will be done. Interesting offer. I'm going to accept it because it gave us a lot more fuel. Now you two are gonna go fix that. Yeah, their health's dropping because there's a breach, so there's no oxygen in there. So now that they fix that, I'm going to open all doors on the inside of the ship, just so then the oxygen vents in there better. Okay. And you guys can just go back to your stations and he'll repair it on his own, because I'm sure he can. Oh, but it's got two bars of damage. Ugh. So you're going to actually go help him. Because we can't leave until that's fixed. And with two bars of damage, we're going to need to repair both, essentially, because we don't want to be going to the next combat situation with a lower chance of things. Yeah. Okay, there we go. And we leveled them up in repair skill. Now this episode's going to go as long as it needs to. And this is Let's Look At, by the way. Not an episode. But it's like it's gonna go as long as it needs to because as soon as I am like, okay, let's take a cut, all of a sudden I'll die, so. Ah, right in the right in the evasion again. I gotta just keep going for that. We will not accept surrender. Okay, so now we're going to target their shields, and we should be able to take them out. There's a mega ship, by the way, at the end of the game that's just essentially like unbeatable, it seems like. Ooh, a burst laser. Not enough power systems. So now we have two Burst Laser Mark IIs up and running. Pretty sweet. We 
really wish that we had more fuel. Sanity jumped to teeth, immediately broadcasting its surrender. Subject wealth, energy, motivational, survival, transfer of goods acceptable. Accept their surrender. <laughs> They'll remember that, but truthfully I plan on dying soon, it seems like anyways. Oh wait, can we? We might be able to get... Upgrade your door system. Yeah, now we got the top level doors. So we want... And we're going to stop our med buddy and this for the moment to one. But we're going to get level 3 shields, that way we're a lot more off or defensively capable. And... That's explored. That's unvisited, so let's go to that before we leave. I know we're wasting fuel, but... Ah, uh, but no fuel in return. I actually would feel a lot better with the mid-bay powered up chest in cage. Case, I mean, and in fact, let's have him heal for a second here. Just for a second, it's not going to take long. Okay, he's already healed. And we're just going to jump out of here and say sayonara to this place. Next sector. I can't go to the nebulas, they're just too unbalanced, I feel like, because right here we could be very crippled without some power in our state because we are on the edge. Okay, an asteroid field. Here we can dominate. Yeah, throw what you got at me. I can take it because I got level 3 shields, so these asteroids aren't going to bother me much. Whereas all I got to do is pierce your shields and the asteroids will become very annoying to you. Take out your weapon systems, and now just let asteroids pelt you all day long, because you're no longer able, capable of hitting us. Oh wait, how'd they take our shields down? So, oh, asteroids probably helped them. Yeah, oh, that's a pretty good haul. Oh no. We have to wait. Request emergency fuel reserves. Buy fuel. Okay, three fuel. That might be enough. At least it got us there on impulse. I've never seen that event actually happen. Aid to civilian ship. So we're going to go immediately for their weapon systems uh, once again. So here's how this is going to go down. We're going to go like this, unlock all the doors, and since that's level 3 it's going to take them forever to breach. In fact, you might not be able to even breach that. It's actually kind of sad, they let them die. So we're going to close all doors, and then we're going to open all doors, just to kind of let. And then we're going to close, and we're going to push enter again. And then we're going to attack their shield systems, and they're done. we got a pretty good setup going right now. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So, uh, since I'm so tempted, I'm just going to buy this just for the extra maneuverability. Ooh, that gave us a lot of fuel, kind of. We're doing pretty good now. 
Okay, so we're going to attack their shields. No, they're weapons. It's always got to be weapons. Oh no, wait, they have a beam. Never mind. We don't need to attack their weapons. They're useless. They can't hurt us. So as soon as we neutralize their shields like we did, they're just done. Oh wait, I forgot about solar flares so. though. We will not accept surrender. Oh, they actually hit us with a fire beam. Oh, that no wait, that was a solar flare, what am I thinking? It's a pretty good haul. So we're gonna just wanna get out of here. Yeah, it's like, who cares? We gotta get out of here. Solar flares are bad news. So we're going to ship with life forms. We gotta investigate. Looks like a massive asteroid directly on course with the region. You had to pull your crew out, but what did they want to grab with them first? Let's grab the stasis chamber. Augment damage stasis pod. Oh wait, I forgot. That's one of the yeah. It actually doesn't matter. Should grab the scraps. Yeah, you live and you learn. Now there's hopefully a shop connected to this because there's so many connections. Truthfully, let's just fight the ship. This might get me killed one of these times though. But we're just gonna fight. So close all doors. Oh, they hit us right in the med bay. So you guys go repair that. We will not surrender. Let's check and see if there's a store. Really? Oh, I should have pushed to enter before we left. Okay, never mind. Nothing happened. So we're going to take this path, even though it's a little bit more dangerous. Oh, they don't even have shields. They're done then. They're asked. Yo, that was the luckiest break ever. So they can't affect us at all. They had their mis. Ooh, and their. Yeah. They just got wrecked. Destroyed. So we could just sit back and relax. Meteorites are gonna hit us, but we got good shields. We're not going to be affected whatsoever. gonna be close getting out of here though. Oh no, we ran out of fuel. Well, it's been good knowing you guys. Yep, here come the rebel fleet. Yeah, and this is why you don't want to be caught by the rebels. Truthfully, I don't know if we even have to worry because of our level 3.
You gotta just focus on those shields. Their shields are too strong right now. Okay, that looks good. Okay, they're shifting power around for some reason. There we go. They're gonna get their shields up, I think, just in time. Yeah, one shield. Yeah, okay, we beat the rebels. But we're still... oh, four fuel. Perfect. Uh, but they can't... we can't escape. They still got us another one. Oh god. We might be too powerful to kind of stop though at the moment. To be truthful. What are they doing? Oh no, they're bombarding us. This is not good. Yep. They're piercing us. We're gonna need to repair that pretty much immediately. Okay, that went good. Not the med bay again. Come on, you guys. Luckily, it hasn't hit any of our crew yet, but. But come on. That kind of hurts. Whoa! I don't necessarily care about our sensors so much. Luckily we're taking them down out of the corner of my eye, I can see. Oh no. It's gonna sting a little bit. We can't jump though until our ba engine bay is repaired. Yeah you guys, this might be it. We can't take another hit. Uh, but we need to keep our guys alive. Yeah, we're dead. Well, you guys, that was a good run. It took 43 minutes. I hope you've enjoyed, and I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye. And I, like I said, I hope you've enjoyed.